Well, hey, real estate fans, welcome back to Southern Oregon's Market Statistic Podcast. I'm Alice Lima. I'm a broker with John L. Scott Real Estate. And uh, this week, we definitely have a trend happening in all three counties, and you'll see what I mean. So starting with Jackson County, prices in Jackson County year over year were up 3% this week. The average residential home in Jackson County now closing at 530,997. So selling for 53997. Number of sold year over year in Jackson County were up 4%. We had 45 closings on SOMLS this week in Jackson County's residential market. Number of listings year over year are up 13%. 858 active listings on SOMLS in Jackson County's residential market this week. We had zero foreclosures close in Jackson County this week, zero short sale close in Jackson County residential this week. We did have $1 million property close in Jackson County. It was, it sold for $1.8 million dollars it was on Surrey Drive in Jacksonville. So congratulations to them. Josephine County prices year over year were up 1%. So about neutral. The average residential home in Josephine County now costing $461,824. The number of solds year over year in Josephine County were down 8%. There were 11 closings on SOMLS in Josephine County's residential market this week. Number of listings were up year over year and they were up by 12% in Josephine County this week. We have 393 active listings on SOMLS for Josephine County's residential markets. We had zero foreclosures closed this week, zero short sales closed this week and zero million dollar properties for Josephine County's residential market. Klamath County prices year over year were up 3%. The average residential home in Klamath County this week now selling for $344,786 on average. The number of solds year over year in Klamath County were up 75%. There were 21 closings on SOMLS in Klamath County's residential market this week. The number of listings are up year over year in Klamath County by 15%. There are now 347 active listings on SOMLS in Klamath County's residential markets. Uh, Klamath County had zero foreclosures, zero short sales, and zero million dollar closings uh, this week in the residential market. So if you did not see the trend, let me point it out. And it's something we've been talking about for months. It's the number of listings year over year consistently going up by double digits in all three counties. So that's really saying something, folks. And um, ironically, as it may be, even with all this new inventory coming on, we still don't have enough to meet current demand for the buyers in all three counties. So this is a little bit of a sweet spot. And we talked about this in the podcast recently where it's kind of a golden opportunity for both buyers and sellers. Um, so, but I understand it's fall and going into winter, um, but this is where, this is the timing. So I'm just here to point out the data. Uh, so having said that, I'd love to be your agent. I'm a great listing agent, great buyer's agent. Reach out to me at 541-301-7980. That's 541-301-7980. Um, and let's talk about what's going on in your real estate life. Um, and if you don't have a real estate life, let's get you one because Southern Oregon is a great place to own real property. Um, also, like and share and subscribe to this podcast. Uh, we love getting our numbers up in that department and uh it's a free education, so send it off to your friends and family, okay? Otherwise, have a beautiful Southern Oregon weekend. We'll see you next time.